and welcome to SJ Highlights. And what I have today is I have a thrift store find, okay? Now, this cost me 50 cents at the thrift store. Anybody else would say, throw it in the trash. What is it even doing there? Why would you buy that? Because it was all tattered and beat up. And what I did was I said, no, I'm going to revamp it. I'm going to make this beautiful, okay? Now, what I did is I put chopsticks in the middle here, all the missing pieces, because it came, it was really in bad shape, you guys. But I was like, 50 cents, I can make this beautiful. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use these gems. I got these gems from Michaels. And I got these gems right here from Amazon. Okay, acrylic gems. And I got my glue sticks. I have my beads. Now, these beads right here, I already have these beads. But I was trying to figure out how am I going to put this on. What I can do is spray paint these silver because I have my, uh, my metallic spray paint here. See that? And I have my glitter, my love, okay? And then I also have my podge. So that's how I'm going to get that glitter on, all right? So I'm going to spray paint these silver. And then I'm going to, see this pointy part? You see that? It's all pointy. And you can't really get it on there. It'll be all, it'll, it'll probably like slide down or something you try to put it on there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray paint this. I'm going to glue it onto the acrylic gem. See, look, it already fell off. I'm going to glue it onto the acrylic gem like this. And that way it'll lie flush onto the sticks. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and spray paint this. Okay. I'm going to spray paint it. And you guys, it's going to be beautiful. Get back to you soon. I'm going to go outside and spray paint it right now. Okay, guys. So it's all spray painted. Doesn't it look different? Whole new lamp. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is Mod Podge, okay? So I'm going to do this Mod Podge. Got my glitter here. Pour a little bit of Mod Podge in the top. Take this brush, sponge brush, glitter. I'm sorry, Mod Podge the sticks on here. Let me put it, turn it down so you can see what I'm doing. Okay. I'm going to take this glitter here, open it, and I'll show you where I'm going with this. It's not going to be heavy on it. It's going to be just just give it a little sparkle here. You don't want it thick. I mean, if you want it thick, you can do it thick, but you know, I like it to be a nice, soft glaze of glitter. So you can still see the silver. Okay, see that? See how I'm doing this right here? Easy as pie. I'm gonna do most, do the rest of it off camera, but I'm gonna show you how it's done so you get the idea. Easy as pie, just like that. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit right here. So. And this my parts dries clear, so see that. Imagine that all over. I'm going to do it all over. Imagine it. how it's going to look. See that? You like that? All right. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you how I'm going to put the beads on. And yes, you guys, my glue gun, my favorite glue gun is blinged out a little bit. I think I'm going to bling it all out. I don't know. <laughs> okay. So. Here we go. You see this? See what I'm doing here? Putting that on there. Focus, focus, focus. All right. See that? Okay, you guys. This is what it looks like. All glittered. Isn't that pretty? You see the difference from where we started and where we are now? Lovely, huh? I'm going to 
use these for a different project because I decided to do something else. So let's see here. I'm going to put the glue directly on. Who is smoking? Directly on the gem. And I'm going to place it in there. And yes, I am. See that? Now with some of them, they don't um, stick with the sticks, but I'm not going to put them directly on the sticks. I'm actually going to put it in the grooves. So it'll actually work like this. Oh. Skip one. I'm skipping each row. this aisle this row here and now I'm gonna go up I started three and I'm gonna go all the way up so I'm just sticking it on the grooves making sure that it's in there good this is this glue will stick and it will hold so I'm skipping rows and I'm going all the way up just cleaning up this extra glue dry glue that um, flyaways okay. skip the road that kind of happens and happens sometimes where I'll go too far or go too close <laughs> so all right so now we're going to the top row Let me show you what I'm doing here. Putting it on the gem, and then I'm placing it on the lampshade. larger gemstones. Isn't that pretty? How pretty is that? Look at it. Alright, so I'm going to put these in the middle here. That. Place that in there. Large gemstones. A little bit more glue around there so it sticks real good. Push it down a little bit when I put it on there. Put that in the grooves because it has those grooves there. So I'm going to follow it all the way up. Right, so now I'm going to go to the top now. Remember, we're skipping rows. Okay, you guys. So, this is what I'm going to do all the way over. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to do it. I tied a knot in this acrylic gem. So it's hanging, okay? I used the clear cord, tied a knot in the acrylic gem. Now I'm going to place it around one of the sticks in a circular motion so that it spins around into place. I'm gonna take my glue gun and I'm going to seal it here so that it's secure. I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to cut off the excess like so. Okay, you see that? And I'm going to keep going all the way until I'm finished. Until I get all the way around. So now we're going to work on the larger gems. Remember we had the smaller ones? Now we're going to work on the larger gems. And we're going to go all the way around with these larger ones. Okay, like this. 
Twirl it. Twirl, 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 twirl. Like that. Glue gun. Oh my goodness, glue gun got me stuck on it. Go ahead and take that down. Okay, now we're going to cut it. See that? And these are the larger ones, so we're going to do these larger ones all the way around, okay? We already made this loop into um, the hole of the larger gemstone. And oh, that came off. Okay. Now sometimes with the um, with the cord, with the stretch cord, it's kind of slippery, so it'll come up. We just to retie it. You know, make sure you get like three or four loops around to tie it. Okay? And that's looking. I'm doing it from an angle, so how does it looking? How's it looking? Looking okay? You like it? You like it? Came a, came a long way, huh? We came a long way. Now, you guys, you can do this too with your thrift store finds. You have, um, get something from the thrift store and revamp it. Don't just let it sit there, you know? Like I said, this was 50 cents. 50 cents and people were walking by it. Nobody wanted it. People were looking like, why is it there? I don't understand. Why would they put this here? And I'm looking like, looking at it like it is. It just need a little love, you know? Every sometimes things just need a little love. That's all. Guys, it's all done. Now this is just to let you know that you can make anything glamorous. You can make anything beautiful. I got, like I said, I got this for 50 cents. And look at what I turned it into. Now you can put this in a um, side table. You can put this in your bedroom, a kid's room, anywhere that you want to glam up. So this is SJ Highlights and I got more coming soon.